Hello everyone. It is a great pleasure to explore our efforts globally and presenting ourselves in the competitive market with latest implementations in trending technologies. We are going to share some important highlights about the implementation of continuous integration and continuous delivery in TIBCO projects using one of the effective open source DevOps tool Jenkins. Here the architecture diagram shows the integration of all the components which contributes eventually in building and deploying the code through development, testing and production utilizing the respective servers, and maintaining highly secured and logging systems. Components like Jenkins, Build Machine, GitLab, Nexus Artifact Repository, Active Directory and Development, Stage, Production Servers can be seen here relatively working for effective DevOps environment. To acquire highly secured and authorized systems, Microsoft AD, Active Directory, will be used for managing groups and its users across the enterprises, and as part of our implementation work, we are using three groups and each group is assigned with respective qualified users. Let us first log in into the home page of the Jenkins portal using Dev Group User and click on My Pipeline tab, which directly opens a Build Pipeline page, where you can see all the dashboards located in their respective groups. When the user triggers job by clicking on Run, the dashboard changes into yellow color which indicates that the job is in running mode. Click on small icon present at rightmost bottom of the dashboard which in turn opens the console to view all the console logs. Artifacts are shown and triggered email details are sent to the next group, and finally the job success message is displayed to show that it is ready to proceed towards next process. You can also find the email sent to the each recipient mailbox notifying that the build is successful. Once the job is done in dev group, the color of dashboard in the build pipe changes from yellow to green as job ran successfully. Once the job successfully starts running, the relative project gets deployed. To view this project, log in into TIBCO Administrator and find it under the Application Management tree. Log in into the Nexus Artifact Repository to search for the respective artifact Observe the artifacts in Maven Snapshots. To proceed to the next level, Stage Admin Group user logins into the home page of Jenkins Portal and clicks on My Pipeline tab. Being an authorized user, the triggering key is enabled for this Stage Admin Group user. For an instance, if Prot Admin Group user logins into the in the home page of Jenkins Portal, being an unauthorized user the triggering key is disabled for this Prot Admin Group user and he cannot trigger the job and find the console logs respectively. So again when the stage admin group user logins into the home page of Jenkins portal and clicks on my pipeline tab, the triggering option which is present at the rightmost bottom of the dashboard is enabled and user can open console and view the logs. You can observe job success message, nexus URLs and triggered email details that are sent to the next group. To view the deployed project, log in into TIBCO Administrator and find it under the Application Management tree. And to find the relative artifacts, log in into Nexus Artifact Repository and observe the artifacts in Maven Snapshots. Eventually the email will be received by the each recipient in the mailbox. Proceeding to the next level of production, let us log in with the Prot Admin Group user into the home page of Jenkins Portal and click on My Pipeline tab to observe the triggering option which is present at the rightmost bottom of the dashboard which is enabled for the respective user only. For an instance, when the Stage Admin Group user logins into the home page of Jenkins Portal and clicks on My Pipeline tab, the triggering option present at the rightmost bottom of the dashboard is shown disabled as he do not have any authorizations at this level. Now again let us log in with the Prot Admin Group user into the home page of Jenkins Portal and click on My Pipeline tab to observe the triggering option which is present at the rightmost bottom of the dashboard. Click on the trigger to open the console, so one can see all the console logs which consists of job success message, nexus URLs and triggered email details that are sent to the next group. Eventually the email will be received at the recipient mailbox which implies that the build pipeline color changes from blue to green, as job ran successfully. To view the deployed project, log in into TIBCO Administrator and find it under the Application Management tree. The relative artifacts are located in the Nexus Artifact Repository. Log in into Nexus Artifact Repository and observe the artifacts in Maven Snapshots. Thank you for watching this video. For any questions, please reach us devops at eaidsb.com.